Hey guys, so we're finally back for part 2 of the men's 200 meters final at the Tokyo um, 2021 Olympics. So these will be the highlights and recap of what has went down. Um, so we definitely saw some great things for the 200. This was probably one of the smoothest 200 turns that um, one of the athletes that I mentioned before, Andre DeGrasse, has done. And we're going to get more into it. So we know that um, coming into the 200, we know that it was going to be a very stacked field. We had some of the big names into the field as well. Some of the bigger names that we had was especially was Andre DeGrasse. We had uh, Kenneth Bernard. We had Noah Lyles. We had um, Knight Knighton. And we had Joseph Stamboli. We had um, Arian Brown. We had Rashad. And we had Richard from the Trinidad the Tobago. So it was such an electric type feel because we didn't even know what was going to happen. But we did know that the Americans were very stacked in the field. We had three Americans taking um, the lanes. So out of lane six, we had the grass. Lane seven, we had a uh, Kenneth. At lane three, we had Noah Lyles. Lane five, we had the ninth, Knighton Arian. And lane eight, we had Joseph. Lane four, we had another Canadian, Aaron. And then Richard from the Jamaica was in lane nine. And then lane two was Jerahim Richard. So now we know that the race was going to be very impactful. But we didn't know how impactful. We definitely see that the men 200 was very electric when it comes to coming off the blocks. We saw that Noah Lyles definitely started leading the pack at first. But at the last curve of the 200 meters, we definitely saw um, Andre DeGrasse and as well as Kenneth Bernard definitely stepped in to to claim the other two spots so as the race started prolonging itself to the second half of the 200 we saw how Noah Lyles start leading by straight away whereas the grass managed to come very smoothly out the curve of the 200 thus surpassing Noah Lyles as well as Bernard to get the definite gold for the one 200 meters after the f going to win his bronze Andre de Grasse has done something that he's been wanting to do for a while he has won the 200 meters with a sensational time result of 19.62 whereas Kenneth Bernard has did a 19.68 and Noah Lyles finished the Olympics with a 19.74 and then Arian finished fourth with a 19.93 and Joseph and the other men from the other countries finished 19.98 and 20.20 .20 and 21.21 and 20.39 so out of all the times the only time that had a national record was definitely Andre de Grasse and then the person from Joseph from lane 8 definitely had a national record from his country too beating his national record meeting the national record so a Canadian national record for Andre de Grasse by running a 19.62 thus making him the gold medalist of the 200 meters final at the Tokyo Olympic Games I am very proud that Andre de Grasse is doing this. I would say out of all the men this year, I think Andre de Grasse is definitely the men to watch, especially in the future of the 200, because how dominant he could be and how smooth he could run the 200. So bronze went to Noah Lyles, silver went to 
um, Kenneth Bernard, and then the gold medalist goes to Andre de Grasse. Now we know that after all this that has happened, we might see them at the Prefontaine Games as well as World Championship will be in Eugene, Oregon next year. So we'll definitely see if they could still show up for all of them to meet up again. But for this moment now, we congratulate Andre de Grasse for winning the gold and Kenneth Bernard winning the silver and Noah Lyle for his first Olympic winning the bronze. So like and subscribe to the channel and I'll definitely see you guys in the next episode.